When you bump into somebody like Dick, who, who had a very much middle class, working class upbringing, he doesn't look at things from the standpoint of the type of successful individual he is today. He looks at it from the standpoint of the type of overall experience he had. There are all sorts of things that we will do as a foundation um, that grow out of the experience of the family. A lot of it had to do with cancer, it had to do with diabetes, it had to do with things that the family experienced. When I first took this job, I uh, suggested to Dick that we might want to sit down and do some strategic planning. And um, as I was going through a brief description of what I had in mind, I could see that his eyes were glazing over. And it was a great lesson to me about how entrepreneurs uh, do their work. It's a foundation that, that's willing to take risks. It's a foundation that also realizes that not every effort and not every investment um, is going to produce success. And that's the way entrepreneurs are. Um, you learn by failing, um, and it doesn't mean that it wasn't a worthwhile uh, endeavor. You know, courage is the resilience or the grit to uh, get up off the mat when, when you're face down and maybe for the third time. He had to do that many times, but there are organizations we deal with who deal with these persistent and important problems who deal with that kind of thing every day. But what Dick experienced here and what the family experienced here was a community that allowed him to develop Best Buy into what it is today um, and allowed him to raise a family into being the kinds of people that they are right now. So um, I think that represents to me a sense of gratitude. I think after uh, the years of working so hard to uh, assemble the wealth that Dick has, he has every right and his family has every right to take great joy in distributing it.